All right, what is going on, everybody? It's American News. I'm bringing you guys another episode to my All Wheel Drive Monster series, and today we're going to do the 2009 Corvette ZR1. And I remember uh, being a little younger. I remember exactly when I was nine. I watched a video on YouTube of this car racing a jet, I believe it was, and completely demolishing the jet. Now that was the day I fell in love with this Corvette. And then I saw the Stingray. wasn't really too fond of the Stingray. The Stingray actually grew on me. And I really like the Stingray a lot now. So we're gonna go ahead and buy this. I picked a nice little black and gray camouflage to go with this car. Uh, you know, uh, I, this is my first time owning this car, so now I have to uh, fully tune this up. Uh, you know, considering that we just, um, considering that we just bought the car, now that we have to uh, fully tune it up, drop down wheel drive conversion, see what engine swaps we have. Um, Pretty sure all we have is a 6.2 liter V8, probably, uh, if we do have an engine swap. And uh, maybe just want to spin this tires already. No upgrades needed, and it's already spinning this tires. I didn't really check its horsepower and all of that before we started this, so I'm actually going to check it now before we all do right, anything dude. to the car. Let me know what you need. 638 horsepower, 604 pound feet of torque, 3,300 pounds uh, is the, uh, the, uh, the stats for this car. Now straight to the conversion setting we don't have an engine swap so that let you know we're already rocking the 6.2 liter v8 most likely dropped all wheel drive conversion in here the aspiration twin turbus twin turbus let's go ahead and drop the twin turbus in there so what uh we might have to drop the front splitter i, I like this splitter we're gonna drop this splitter uh i feel like the spoiler is gonna be completely ugly and i was correct we're not dropping the spoiler now we're gonna go ahead and drop the rim, uh, not the rim, but the tires. And um, all right, so 305s on the front. Uh, probably gonna go 345s on the back. I'm pretty sure that's what we got. 355s, I was short. Uh, 20 inches in the back, actually. I'm not uh, gonna fiddle with any of the, um, the tire sizes or um, any really, any rims really. I feel like I just leave those the same and not bother those at all. Um, yeah, we're just gonna go ahead and fully tune this up. Uh, get a max speed. Um, all right, so once we get to the horsepower, we're gonna make my horsepower guess. Um, this thing is slammed, slammed, dropped it an inch. It's already like like two inches from the ground now. That is insane. Um, <laughs> this thing is already pretty low to the ground. It's pretty small. You know, I've always thought the Corvette was kind of small. We're going to drop the roll cage in there just for acceleration. The acceleration dropped. That's only because we haven't done the weight reduction. Look at that. Look at that acceleration just shoot up to 9.5. Now, that's what I like to see. 3,000 pounds. That is pretty damn good. Now, we're going to go ahead and get the horsepower. We're at 671 to start off. I feel like we're going to be at the 900 horsepower range. If not, we're going to hit 1,000. Um... That's just my guess. If you guys have any guesses of what the horsepower is going to be at, leave it in the comment section now before the actual horsepower range comes up or pops up. Um, yeah, we might actually be past <laughs> a thousand horsepower. I guess the thousand horsepower. I guess nine hundred to a thousand. We might actually uh, bypass that uh, with ease. Uh, let's see where we're, we're at eight eighty five now. Um, all right. Uh, yeah, we're at 904. Haven't touched the turbos at all. Turbos might actually drop 100 horsepower uh, or more into this. Uh, you know, that's just my guess. I don't know. I've been wrong already. Drop the flywheel in there. We're at 2969 pounds. Now, that is actually going to rise once we drop these race turbos in here. 38 horsepower on the turbos. They're cheesing us now. This is not good. 1.7 is 0 to 64.2 seconds, 0 to 100. Okay, all right, so we're at 976 horsepower, so I was actually correct. Uh, we actually hit 900 horsepower. That was my guess was 900 to 1,000. We're like right smack down in the middle. Um, well, not really the middle, but you know, we're at the tip top. The tip, the tip top, we're at, we're at the tip top middle. But uh, now we're going to go ahead and see what it sounds like because I already know it sounds devilish. I know this thing sounds really good, and it's always raining now. Like, stop raining. I can't really do much in the rain. But anyways, let's go ahead and see how it sounds. Where's the backfire? Give me that backfire. No backfire? Okay. Oh! 
My insurance company, Allstate, will be contacting you, sir. All right, now let's go ahead and keep it moving. Oh, this is crazy. Oh, I missed this dash. Oh, my Lord. I missed this so much. The gears are short, though. I kind of noticed that. The gears are relatively short. We might have to um, buff these gears up a little. Let me see, because there's, yeah, there's only the sixth gear. We might have to actually buff these gears up just a little bit. Uh, I feel like these gears are a little too short. Actually, it might be just right, actually. I don't know. We'll, we'll, we'll see once we do this little top speed run right here. Uh, so we can see. Uh, yeah, the gears are actually really sh they're too short. Uh, I'm, I'm, I have a feeling that the gears are like slammed into the front. Yep, I was correct. We're not going to drop this all the way down. We're probably going to drop the three flat, see what that gets us. Uh, we could probably go down a little more to 2.8 for frontal drive. I usually only change frontal drive. Seems like it's the best to uh, change. Now we're going to go ahead and up these up one so that there are whole numbers instead of being randy numbers like that. Uh, let's see how this works out. This might be a lot better. Uh, yeah, six gear has a lot more room. Might have to just test the other gears, see what the other gears are running at, see what they're working with. Uh, it's top speed looks like it's going to be around 225, maybe 230, or probably even more, maybe 240. So we might, uh, we might actually have to, uh, gonna have to U-turn this around. All right, now let's see what this thing can actually do now. See what the top speed comes out to be. I was just silent for a few seconds. I kind of just noticed that. But we're going to go ahead and see what the top speed comes out to be now. It's in that we just changed the gears. Oh, that is good. That is beautiful. That is beautiful. We're at 210 miles an hour, still gaining speed. This is why I always like the Corvette. The Corvette is seems to never disappoint. Uh, when it when it comes to Chevy, Chevy knows how to make their muscle cars without a doubt. Um, you know, really they know how to make cars. Period. I, I kind of like all of Chevy's cars, but their muscle cars always seem to impress. Uh, you know, it's always, it's known from Chevy now to be impressed with their cars. 230 seems like to be the top speed. We can't really get more. I'm gonna bank that 20k we have right there for uh, points. Go ahead and get that. Get some more wheel spins for another wheel spin episode. Uh, now I kind of like doing those episodes, so we might actually do one next episode. Who knows? Uh, might have to do it. But if you guys did enjoy, make sure you guys leave a like, follow my Twitter, follow my stream. If you guys have any suggestions, make sure you guys hit me up on Twitter or in the comment section. I'm open to all suggestions and all the recommendations. Uh, constructive criticism, anything you guys need to tell me, let me know. Uh, you know, leave it in the comment section or tweet at me. You know, I'm always down to hear what anybody has to say. Um, you know, I'm always down for it. And uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. And if you guys did enjoy, make sure you guys follow me. I, I just said all that already. So yeah, I'm Nukes and I'm out. Peace.